What's up, everybody? Welcome, Spot Spot, and welcome to Slav Guns on Tour. We're at Shot Show 2023, and I'm at a booth that I absolutely wanted to make sure that it stopped by at Accurate Mag. So, uh, you guys love the channel. We do a lot of 6.5 PRC content, and almost every 6.5 PRC video, you see an Accurate Mag for 6.5 PRC because they're the only ones that are really kind of specialty made for it, and they actually work. Absolutely. Then I went on the website and I was completely shocked to find out that you do more than mags. And the first one was like, well, like, you guys make a chassis. And then a couple of days before SHOT Show, I got an email like, hey, we also have actions and guns. So I'm here with Wilson, who's going to talk to us all about this awesomeness. And well, you got more details. So first of all, Wilson, thank you very much for having me. Thank I'm you. excited. I'm giddy. Wonderful. Precision rifles make me... Cool. So, walk us through it. <laughs> Precision rifles make us all excited. Um, this is our new AM 725A1 rifle. Uh, it is our AM 725 action, which is Remington 700 short action pattern okay. action. Uh, 60 degree bolt throw with a three lug action. Um, M16 style extractor. And it comes in our sport tact chassis system okay. with the stratum folder buttstock here and our new PRS forend, which has Arca Rail and M-Lock compatibility on it. So let's go start, start with the action, because I mean, that was something really cool. And like you said, it was a three lug 60. So I played with this before we started working with this and I did not realize it was a three lug 60. And the reason why is the bolt throw was so atypical to a typical three lug 60. So with smaller 60 degree bolt throws, it's, it takes a lot more effort so I'm doing it backward. There, yeah, there we go. <laughs> it takes a lot more effort to uh, run the bolt, and it's actually freaking smooth on this. This one is really smooth. I've had this rifle with me for a couple weeks. It's a demo rifle, and it's a really nice angle. Just short pop and right back in makes it really smooth with that timing that we were able to engineer into this action. So the action-wise, are you doing? Are you selling it as a barreled action, or is it just a? a can somebody buy just the action? or basically, are someone gonna have to buy the entire gun? So we have three options here. Okay. Uh, we will sell just the bare action itself. Okay. We also sell barreled actions with the Action R barrels in either 308 or 65 Creedmoor okay. and the Trigger Tech Trigger in them. Okay, so yep. 700 footprint, 700 triggers? Yep, 700 triggers. Okay, so I know basically people get like very personal about for triggers, be beyond the single stage versus two stage. Um, so you can use a 700 trigger of your choice. Yeah. Um, so roughly, what's the pricing and availability on the actions? And are we going to have to buy? Are we going to have to wait for actions and basically buy the guns first, or how does that process work? Everything's available right now. Okay. So you can order whatever you'd like. Uh, we're getting it up on our website shortly. Okay. And um, what was your pricing? Pricing. Yes. So for the whole rifle, we're looking at about 3,500. Okay. For a barreled action with the trigger, it's 2,000. Okay. And then it is 1,250 for the action itself. Okay. So I'm very definitely very reasonably priced for an action, which a lot of them I mean, look very really going up. I know material costs have increased. Yes. But I mean, you start seeing actions like closer to 2,000 dollars, and it's like, eh. Yep. So this is definitely very much attainable. Absolutely. And all of our stuff is American made. Okay. It's all made in uh, Connecticut. Okay. And so, you know, we strive to keep the price in a reasonable level while keeping American made parts on the rifle. Okay. So. so this one is in a standard act. It's a standard action with a standard bolt face. Um, any yes. plans for like a Magnum bolt face or like 6.5 Grendel bolt face for the guys who are running six arcs, things like that. We've got some stuff in the pipeline. Uh, we're not releasing that yet though. Okay. So. And I guess basically somebody's going to, if somebody's going to want a longer action that might possibly down the road. That's a possibility in the future. Send us an email and we'll see what we can do on that. Okay. So we talked about the action definitely looks really, really cool. Um, talk about us about the chassis itself, because I mean, it definitely, I mean, it screams that it's made for anybody who's a long range shooter or a PRS. So you have the Arca rail. Talk about the modularity on it because it was a little bit interesting. So. Our chassis are three different pieces here. Okay. You've got the buttstock, the center section, and the forend. Okay. Um, our buttstocks and forends are interchangeable, so we have a variety of different offerings. Okay. We have seven different forend options, wow. and we have four different buttstocks. Um, between folding, like this rifle has, and this is our stratum stock, we have our um, other folding style with the plastic side pieces okay. on it. We do full M-Lock wraparound forends and 
Uh, we do half four ends. We've got a lot of different options for what you want to set up your rifle. So for. anybody who's watched my channel knows that I love shooting off of tripods, especially if you're older, teaching somebody new how to shoot, you have back issues. And it's definitely the trend, but I do know that some people don't want RK yet, or they don't want to be kind of quote unquote first adopters. So you have traditional type uh, four ends as well for those. Or if somebody just wants like a slimmer line, because this definitely does have, ARC is awesome, but it does have a little bit of an edge to it. It does. Versus this, you can almost easily grab around yep. and that. Okay, so uh, what's the pricing and how would somebody get a chassis from you guys? So chassis are available on our website. Okay. We have six different options that are pre-configured and then you can also do an a la carte, sort of build your own style if you'd like that. So all of that pricing varies depending on the components. Uh, roughly what ballpark? Um, anyway, well, it's hard to say because we have some okay. have small chassis like this. That so if you want to do like an AR pistol, right. uh, I'm looking at this, I'm like, okay. I'm sorry, not AR pistol, uh, a bolt, action, bolt pistol, action pistol. And I'm like, this is gonna be perfect for like, uh, so we're working on 8.6 Blackout project with Faxon and Q. I'm like, this is awesome. But yeah, so this is small and you can basically add any buttstock that you want. Right, it's okay. an AR carving style buttstock. Yep. So, you know, this also works great for a light hunting rifle configuration. You know, put on a collapsible stock and a short barrel and with this sport fore end, okay. it's very light package. All right. Um, so you go anywhere from around $500 on this up to $1,300 okay. for our Elite Series, yeah. uh, which includes the Stratum stock and our higher end for So, I mean, definitely in line with others, almost like maybe a little bit on a lower end. Well, is it? They're doing it. Lower end as in terms of the price, not the features and the quality. Absolutely. Okay. Yes. And if somebody wants, like, are generally most of the parts in stock or like what's the lead time on it if somebody orders it? We have everything in stock at this point, so we can assemble it and get it out to you. Okay. Uh, we offer a variety of different center sections for different okay. inlets. Uh, we can do Remington short action and okay. long action, Savage short and long action, okay. Ruger Gunsight Scout, okay. Tika T3X, uh, Rangemaster Precision Arms, and we have left-handed patterns in a few of those. All right, so left-handed is definitely going to help the wrong-handed people. Like me. I I'm waiting for that insult. Half my family's left-handed. In Soviet Russia, we teach it out of you. Uh, <laughs> and apparently we did in Catholic schools here too in the past. Yeah, absolutely. Um, but you know what, like, so you said Tika, and I know you're gonna have like the Tika fanboys are gonna go completely crazy over that, yep. but it's good. Yeah, Tika's uh, a new offering for us. So. Any other plans, let's say for example, like Ruger Americans, uh, any other rifles, any other inlets coming down the pike? Not at the moment. Okay. Yeah. But I guess if there's enough requests, go bug them yep. and maybe we'll make it happen. Absolutely. Awesome. Uh, and I guess so your magazines are available through other distributors as well. Are the chassis and rifles going to be a, as well or is this going to be something that's going to be direct from your website? Um, we have a couple of distributors okay. that carry them in limited quantities. We are trying to expand that, but our website's always a reliable place to get them. And that's basically if you want a, like a weird configuration, that's going to be the place to get it anywho. Yes. Likely. Awesome. So that is the new pistol chassis the new chassis and new custom actions by Accurate Mag. You love our magazines, they work, and these definitely look good too. If you wanna see these on the channel, do leave them in the comments below along with your questions. And as always, thank you guys for watching. Wilson, thank you very much for having me here, showing Great us with you. a gun. Yep. And we'll see you in the next video linked up here. Awesome, thank you. Great. See, that wasn't bad. No, not too bad. I don't know. You're the marketing person, it's your job.